Hi guys, today I have a haul video for you and this is sort of a haul of things I've collected over quite a bit of time, so maybe a month or so. It's pretty much all clothes stuff apart from one thing, so I will start with that one thing. And that one thing is this. We had some measuring scales before and they broke and then my mum came home with this and I was like, oh, I love it. Because I've seen it in Wilkinson's over and over and over again and really wanted it, but never got it because we didn't need it and you know, just didn't just didn't get it but it was reduced from 10 to 6 pounds so my mum was like I'm grabbing that and it looks really nice in our kitchen next to our sort of vintagey style toaster as well and it's got all the numbers and things pounds kilograms all of that you know ounces whatever you like to measure in the next thing is a pair of shoes and I kind of put myself on a little bit of a spending run it wasn't a spending run it was more of a rocky stop looking on the internet and buying things that you don't need um, but clearly I have no self-control and I was like I really need a pair of black shoes because I've got black boots and I've got sort of low brown boots but I don't really have any black shoes apart from my black docks which are really quite bulky so I needed something like this so I got these and I saw them on office and I fell in love and I was like I need those in my life because I've seen quite a few like this I've seen them patent and I've seen them in weird colours um, but I liked these because they are in sort of a soft leather. I think they were around £50 but I used student discount and got a little bit off them so it wasn't too bad but they're still quite expensive for just a shoe. Some of you will know that us beauty and fashion bloggers often get given things or sent things by companies so that we can show them to our audiences which is you guys. And one of the companies I recently started working with is Choi's or Shoi or... And they kindly sent me this to show you. This is something I chose from their website and I love it. It's so just classic and lovely. It's houndstooth and black and white. And it's got this pop of yellow underneath in the lining and on the sleeves. I got this in a small and I probably could have done with a medium um, because it is close fitting. But I think it's fine, really. It's quite lightweight so it doesn't make you feel heavy and bulked up like some of my other blazers do. And I think this is something everyone should have in their wardrobe really, just a nice sort of printed blazer. I must be having a thing for Houndstooth at the moment because I bought another Houndstooth item and this was from a charity shop and I think this is one of my favourite purchases recently. This is a lovely sort of pencil skirt. It's not very long, it's quite short and it's high waisted and it's got these cute little details on the back which I think is really nice and it just fits beautifully. I find it very difficult to find pencil skirts or straight up and down skirts that actually fit me because I've got quite big legs and quite big bum but quite a small waist for my bum waist ratio and it was only £3.50 so can't really say no to that. I didn't intend on buying two hands two things and I probably could wear these things together but I probably won't. As I said earlier, I work with companies and another one of the companies I work with, which is one of my favourites, is Runway. And I have found some amazing things on their website and it's usually the things that they make by themselves. So it's like their own brand of things. Sometimes they stock other brands on their website. This is just the Runway stuff and the Runway stuff that is made by them is amazing and I've not really seen it anywhere else. They sent me a few things this month and one of the things they sent is this. This is a black skater dress with half sort of sleeves. I will link all of these in the description so you can go and check them out. Another thing I got from Romwe is this red cropped jumper and this is lovely. I love this. I've worn it already because I just couldn't help myself. It looks really nice with jeans and I think it would look really nice over dresses as well. It's really quite wide in the shoulders. I mean, if you can see this, it probably takes up the whole screen. Yep. I mean, my shoulders are not that big, but it's sort of a bat wing kind of style. They do this in a couple of other colours, I believe they do it in a couple of pastel colours and maybe a cream. So if you're interested in this in other colours, then go and check those out. The last thing I got from Romwe, which is something that hasn't come off my body at all, apart from being washed. As soon as it's been washed, I've like waited for it to dry and then put it back on and worn it out somewhere. I keep wearing it out, I keep wearing it everywhere and I think my friends are probably a little bit sick of this skirt. Um, but it's this and it's a corduroy mustard skirt and it fits me so nicely. It's just lovely. I love it. Most skirts are quite short on me because I've got a big bum so you know it cascades over and just doesn't quite get around to the right point on your leg. I made sure when I ordered this that it would be a bit longer. I checked all the measurements. I would recommend doing that if you're ordering things online. Measure it against skirts that you already have. And even though it's corduroy it's still very light and it just flows beautifully. I love this. It's my new favourite thing. I know I said that about my other skirt, but 
I just like skirts at the moment, I guess. So that's pretty much it for the stylish fashion-y things, but I've bought a couple of other things. And the first thing are these pair of shorts. These are from Primark, and I think they were like five pounds, six pounds, I don't know, can't really remember. But they're just little shorts, and they've got bright pink on the top and on the back on the bottom. I really, really want some Nike free runs. Can someone just buy me those, like, Nike? Do you want to send me some free runs? Because I would highly appreciate it, thanks. And finally, the last thing I got is a onesie, and it's quite an overpriced onesie, in my opinion. It's not brilliant quality, it's quite thin and quite see-through, but it's the only onesie I have found anywhere that actually fits me. Onesies are always too long, too wide, too big, just too everything, whereas this one actually fits me properly. Even the size 8 pyjama onesies from Primark are way too big, but they're massive. And I'm a 10, 12, so what's your excuse for that, Primark? It looks like this. It is stripy. It's white, but I wouldn't really say it's white. It looks kind of off-white. And it's stripy all the way down. All the way everywhere. And that is it. That is the end of my haul. I hope you enjoyed watching me talk about things that I've bought over the past however long. As I said earlier, I will link all the things in the description box if I can find them online. All my social networks and everything like that also in the description. I'm on Instagram quite a lot, so if you want to follow me on there, my username is rockya underscore d. I shall see you soon. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye. My voice goes, my voice always goes when I speak. Should we start that again? Yeah. Not gonna say that, I don't like that. I've got hairspray on my phone, that's really good. This is wobbling, will you stop? It's true. It is, shall we check that? Let's check that. I bet she knows.